trying to get used to their new home. I think they're trying to figure out what the heck to do. <laughs> Doesn't look anything like your old home, does it? But look at these worms just going to town. I did catch two worms mating and uh, yeah, I guess those are the ones. <laughs> Getting right back at it, eh? Guys, this is it. You've all come to this dark corner of the YouTube interverse to get your dirty, filthy appetites and desires satisfied with green grow spaces worm porn. So <laughs> let's get into it, shall we? But before we do, it would only be appropriate to get into some shout outs. And I gotta shout out that earwig that was just crawling across the screen right there. Here, let's get another shot of that earwig for you, okay? Oh, there's the earwig. There it is. Yeah, you see it in the left-hand corner there? Shout out to your earwig. Do your thing, buddy. Anyway, back to the worms. Uh, a bunch of these worms were caught, or I should say, well, trapped <laughs> by me, the worm hunter, <laughs> underneath a pile of cedar leaves. So they really, really love their cedar leaves. And I know that these babies will turn some, turn some of the leaf that I end up putting into this pile into beautiful castings for me, which is exactly uh, what I need these worms to do. Um, and those be the more red worms that you see, which are the ones that primarily take care of uh, the uh, the dead and decaying organic matter towards the surface of the soil level. And uh, really, they love those fresh leaves as well as a nice treat too. But um, I made sure though to get a diverse selection of worms because it takes all kinds. For example, let's take a look at these two right over here. No, nope, not those two. Those two aren't the ones. Wait a second. Let's get there. You, there we go. Yeah, those two. Those two. Those two worms. When I caught them, they were fucking out in the wild. Um, they were just wildly fucking. So it's a good thing that they stuck together in my little uh, transportation compartment and uh, made it into this bin together. And they're just continuing what they're doing. And that is exactly what I want to see. Some classic worm porn for you right there. And here, this roly poly just came out of the dark crack. Uh, I was getting a blowjob from one of the worms, I think. It turns out that this worm's actually not dead, in fact. Uh, so, made me look like a jackass calling it a dead worm, and then it wasn't even dead. Uh, <laughs> that's a bad one, you know? <laughs> Makes me think of the times when, uh, all of those times back in the day where they didn't have an ability to tell whether or not you were actually dead before they buried you. How crazy is that? That they used to actually have a bell, okay? They used to have a bell <clears throat> at the grave site, just in case, just in case someone, just in case someone fucked up <laughs> and buried you alive, you'd ring that bell and, uh, you know, hope, hopefully someone comes and saves you from that hell. I mean, really, what a way to go, eh? Like, you die, then you're alive, then you die. Anyway, enough of that. Back to the worms. That one's on the move. Look at that one go. Wow. Just been watching that one. That's a pretty active one. Pretty active. Oh, there's a... There's an earwig. Running across the scene. Oh man, I don't know if any of you have ever woken up in the middle of the night uh, and stared an earwig right in the eyes <laughs> as it's been sitting on that pillow there uh <laughs> ready to take that leap into your mouth but anyways they are creepy looking things but look at that thing go holy shit it's so fast you know the no-till community should have earwig races every year that's what i think trying to get used to their new home i think they're trying to figure out what the heck to do <laughs> doesn't look anything like your old home does it but look at these worms just going to town on each other eh? so I, as i said i did catch two worms mating and uh yeah, I guess those are the ones. They're just... yeah. <laughs> Getting right back at it, eh? <laughs> That's good. It's good. That's what I want to see. It's pretty awesome. Okay, cool. Here we have a very curious worm. Just trying to figure out exactly what the heck is going on now. It's starting to go down. It's starting to burrow. Oh, I guess not. Uh, this one was a leaf eater. It's, it's looking for leaf. 
I'll tell you one thing that worm is not looking for, and it's a fucking earwig, man. Those things are freaky. Oh, there's that. Oh, there's that dead, that quasi dead worm, that really pale looking thing that you see in the front. And something tells me that I may have actually chopped that puppy up somehow, somewhere along the way, because it doesn't look too healthy. I haven't quite decided what I'm going to do with that quasi-dead worm, but I'll probably just end up burying it and attach a string to its toe, and then the other end to a bell, and it can ding the bell if it's alive. Stones, with his machinations and his palindromes It was anything but hear the voice Anything but hear the voice It was anything but hear the voice It says that we're all basically alone And burn us all the way And turn into a playground To a petri dish Where single cells would swing the fists At anything that looks like easy prayers Nature show that rages every day Was then the part of intuition Say We were all basically alone And despite what all the studies had shown That was mistaken for Closeness was just a case for mitosis When the sun shone on mercy While all those were painfully shy And tell me, Dr. Kane, you quantify He just wants to know symbol and or an upside down moth it looks like an alien spacecraft right in the middle of my window like if I go back and you take a look there's like right right in the middle oh I guess you can't really see it from here but there it is yeah see here's the window boom right in the middle that's cool all right the Robin's back oh there we go 
flew. It's flying, uh, yeah, flew away, never mind. <laughs> Robin came back, say hi for a second, took off again. Thought I was gonna ask it to uh, help me cut the lawn, probably, no doubt. Look at that crazy lawn, wow.